The World Health Organization has declared a swine flu pandemic. The Zika virus continues to infect people. The new respiratory virus called MERS. SARS killed nearly 300 A big people. outbreak of the deadly Ebola virus. The outbreak spread widely and cannot be contained. There is such a thing as being too late. If we do nothing, it's not a matter of if there will be a global pandemic. It's just a matter of when. Our world is globalizing ever more. That's fantastic from the perspective of a virus because in no time it can infect hundreds of thousands of people. Here's what a worst case scenario pandemic would look like. First, there would be a jump from some animal species to the people close to those animals. It would not be regionally confined for long at all. The large number of casualties and the deaths are unthinkable. Shannon was in her senior year of high school. The doctor said it was just the flu, that it had to run its course. 911, what is going on there? My daughter, she's not breathing. Even the most healthy person is taken away from this planet within a couple of days. We are imposing changes in the world thoughtlessly. This is an issue of human life. It should be thought of in the same way that we think of terrorism, protection against national disasters, against national defense. You hope the world has the capacity to see an outbreak, mobilize forces, and contain it. We have a chance to stop something that otherwise could be horrific, but it's going to take all of us. So it's really act now or pay later.